should probably plant a city somewhere in here. But, you know, things for another time. Oh, are those ruins? That's awesome. Okay. Waiting for the turn to end and waiting for the turn. Waiting for the turn to turn so I can burn some people down. I'm singing something. My improv singing. It's not the greatest at sometimes, okay? I'm sorry. It just happens. Come on, people. Get your stuff done. I want to take people over. I want to ruin lives. I want to ruin lives. Let me ruin lives, please. Come on. Come on. Okay. Choose production. I'm gonna actually get a factory or a market. Get more gold from a market, we get way more production. We're gonna build a factory. Down here. We're gonna go there. Awesome, I got a scout. Okay. Okay. Alright, it looks like we might have a connection to the Congo over there. But for now, we can come down here and we can start blocking things off, it looks like. I bought a builder. Okay. We're gonna fortify your scout. I'm gonna send you off into the far reaches. There we go. You need orders. I get nine gold if I traded with Preslov, but it'd take a lot of turns. Sarpsburg, Nidoros, give me five production. I'm gonna take nine turns. So that's what we're gonna do. Bergen is gonna receive things, so we're good. This is all gonna work out, in my opinion. All right, next turn. Sit back and crack a lack. Wow, that was quick. Okay. We need orders. Oh, okay. Um, let's see. Can I... Okay, I can buy those tiles. But I can only afford one. So we're gonna buy that one. Alright, in the next two two turns from now, we should have something built there. Some kind of improvement. Now, can, I don't think we can put any improvements on the hills of Dover. I don't think that you can do that. I'm not sure. I'll have to test that theory. But we are making more gold now. 67, almost 68 gold per turn. Oh, what? Are you guys scared of my apostles? Yeah, you don't want to get punked out with my apostles, Russia? If not, okay, you want my religion? I'll spread my religion to you. Okay, if you want it that badly, I'll do it. I just gotta wait for the turn to cycle. I'm gonna get a bunch of guys, I'm gonna send them over to you, and I'm just gonna convert you to my religion. Because you seem so dead set on it. Maybe I'll go to war with Preslav, since everyone else is doing that. Alright. Okay, yeah, we can work on that. But for now. Okay, so they're only a melee unit. So we're gonna go with a private team. Cause you guys want a bunch of stuff, but you got a builder up here, so we don't gotta worry about that. Okay, so a campus. You are going to build 
a mine. You guys are gonna go straight south. Same for you. Can that, does that even work that way? No, no it doesn't. Alright, so... Okay, you guys are just gonna plant it here. Same for you guys. Okay, so this doesn't connect over here at all, which is good. And I'm not sure if this general can fight, but we're going to find out. Alright. Jeez, with these guys. Like, man, it's, it's really, there's too many of them. And I'm real tempted to attack. Yeah, that's what I thought. Right, I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna buy some religious units, like I said I was gonna do. These guys, I'm just gonna move over so I can get the Congo to quit being an a-hole to me. If they wanna be Mui Tortoise, they can be Mui Tortoise. I do not care. If they wanna be more Tortoise than fine. Mui. Mui is more, or is Mui? I should have made it Grand Tortoise. Grande Tortoise. That's what I should have made the religious name. Uh, I really missed a thing there. Okay. Religious. Here we go. Dominant religion in five cities. You must have spent an apostle to launch Inquisition before purchasing Inquisitors. Oh, really? That's all you guys got? Okay. You can go that way. You're gonna go this way. That'll help us figure out the land boundaries while we're at it. Okay. Okay, so I think the Congo's right here, so we're gonna plan it. You're going to... Wait, so I can see if I can afford this tile, which I can. There, we've completely locked them out of here. Which is good. Okay. Right, you're a pikeman. You're gonna fortify. You're gonna come over here. Okay, you're gonna build that production improvement. You're gonna come down here. Right, I found the start of what I believe is Saladin. So I'm going to make sure he can't expand northward. Whoever is there, I'm going to make sure they can't expand northward. I'm going to found a city right here. And then I'm going to found a city right here. That'll stop them from progressing northward via land. Which is good. I may also try and put a city right here. Which would be good. If it doesn't connect to anything else, I'll have to figure that out. Um, now to the open borders. Uh, you, no, to the 117 gold for 30 turns. No, I, I would rather do turn by turn. I mean, I I do just have it, so I mean, it's not a big deal. So. Yeah, sure. I'll, I'll take that. That's gold I need in my pocket. So I'm okay with that. Alright, I'm still getting 54 gold per turn, which is excellent. Let's see what happens, boys! <sighs> oh, I did get new headphones. Uh, main reason being... Well, I've, I've had these headphones for about four years, 
They're uh, Kraken Pros. I love these headphones. They are fantastic. The problem is, uh, this jack on the end is bad, and I can fix it, but it's gonna require a little bit of a little bit of work. And what happens is, only one side will work unless it's Jimmy just right, and that's because of severed connections in the head of the jack, and this is also cracked. The jack itself is cracked. So, all right, you want open borders? No. But what if, if you, you don't, I'm not going to give you open borders, but what would you give me for tobacco? Okay. Would you give me two gold per turn? No? Okay, how about diamonds? If I gave you diamonds, what would you give me in return? A horse. I don't want a horse, I want gold per turn. Let me just do a miracle. Wow, what? No, what would you give me? Seven gold per turn. And a horse for 30 turns, plus open borders for diamonds and tobacco. You have yourself a deal. I will take that. I mean, I get a horse in return, which is more useful to me. So, yeah, totally. I will totally take that. I wish I had more great works because I have all the space to hold them. Can you pillage great works from other nations? I'm gonna have to figure that out. Hopefully you can. I really hope you can. Hopefully you can hear all this music. I won't know until afterwards. How much damage have they done to me? It can't have been much. It's not. Oh, really now? You are not that smart. Alright, next one. I should definitely get metal casting. But I should also get printing. So we're gonna get metal casting first. We're gonna upgrade the black striders so that we get the boost. That was only five turns. The factory's not gonna be done for eight more turns, so we're gonna build another trader. They want to build something. Uh, holy site? But it'd be for Judaism. An industrial zone? I could totally do an industrial zone. Or an encampment. Industrial zone. You, who needs orders? You do? Okay, just plant it right there and make sure no one... Just go to sleep right there. You're gonna build a lumber mill there. You're gonna go up to here, and you're gonna just do all of that. Okay. I'm gonna automate exploration. Okay, the Apostles are going to start making their way over. You need something to do. Okay. Make bad. Okay. So I'm definitely going to make that farm. For now, I'm going to buy that tile. You're going to take that gold, and then you're going to attack them. Well, you kill them, though. That's the thing. Immediately, you decimate it. Which is fantastic. You're gonna go over there and wait till next turn. Now, I could sell them. I could cheat. I could sell them. It would give me some gold back. I know that's a thing. I'm gonna do it. Wow. Okay. Yeah, that's... Okay, yeah, that's awesome. That, that gave me way more gold than I thought it was going to. They cost me 220 and I got 150 back. That's that's awesome. Okay. Production wise, you want a factory as well. So in three turns I'll let you do that. Alright. Just trapping scouts. 
was trapping him. Yes. Oh, it's 1920, by the way. So World War I has broke out, uh, and it's wound down. Now we need to start, or, or yeah, so we're doing the build-up to World War II now. So, except this time, Norway is going to be an aggressor, hopefully. I hope it's not like the atomic age and I'm still rocking this. Uh, I'll be right back. <clears throat> I have returned. Okay. Settler. Or settler or builder. I'm gonna do settler. Next settler. I can do privateer. I'm gonna do another privateer and then I'll have my arm. But you an automated exploration as well. You can get a promotion. Hmm. We're going with, with that one. Whoa! I can turn barbarians. Um, that, never mind. You're going to be useful. And I'm going to find some barbarians for you to convert. Jeez, that would have been nice to know earlier on. I could have had all those barbarians. I could have had barbarian swordsmen fighting for me. Man, of course. Of course that's how it plays out. Alright, you're going to fortify. New orders. Um, uh, buy that tile. You would get the most use out of going to... Preslav, actually. So, go to Preslav. Nice. Okay. Fortify. Okay. Well, not bad. Starting to make some headway here. Okay, Nidoros is 16 population, and they're about to hit the next level. Okay, you're going to make... There we go. Okay, I believe that's everything. Alright. Sweet! I'm just slowly converting everything. See, that's five? That's awesome. It's not five production. It's going to help speed their stuff along real nicely. Toronto has given you a new quest. Trigger a Eureka moment for scientific theory. I'll try my best, Toronto. You bet. Okay, so the thing to do would be to find barbarian villages in enemy territory using this guy to convert them to my units. All just barbarians using a religious charge. That would definitely, though, if there are any left, that's the way to go. I'm actually gonna spend time making him do that and see what happens. This guy's got 
he can spread religion four times. If he dies... In theological combat is where two religions fight each other, I believe. Which would create a relic if he died doing that. I was changed. I already just passed. Before to establish new embassies without friends and allies. Diplomatic service. Awesome. Okay. Okay. I don't know why it glitches like that sometimes, and I don't like when it does it. Lighthouse. You're gonna keep going. And you're gonna start heading this way. You're gonna just gonna scout them out. Benefit of religions, right? There we go. Awesome. And after they produce that, I'm gonna start working on getting more religious units so I can start converting them. That way I can declare religious wars so I can take over my enemy that way because it's really useful and you don't get nearly as much of a warmonger detrimental effect. You uh, you having fun up here buddy? Just uh, yeah? You're over here so. You, I need to figure out what's over here too. Okay. That's that's not the bottom of the map, I don't believe. There's probably more. I did go with a huge map. A huge map. And the only people I've seen are the Congo. Who are while they have they they're in a farther age than me, they have less population. And, in th and they have weaker units, so in theory, I could go in there with enough units and, you know, bonk their faces. Awesome. Okay, what are you going to produce? Requires population of 19 to produce a campus. Industrial zone requires 3 population. Okay. So, I can make a spy. You want a factory. You can get a factory. Or a settler. We're gonna get factory. You're gonna find a city right there. Okay, a shipyard. Encampment. A holy site and an industrial site. If I put it there, that would be good. Right there. Get adjacency bonuses, which is nice. Okay. And then you've been made, so you can start mosaying all that way. You can't really do anything right now. But you can work your way over there. Alright. Okay. I oh, welcome. Good. Awesome, I'm glad you're part of my religion now. Oh, and I'm gonna keep converting you. Because I have the ability. Alright, see that? See, I could... If I have enough religion there, I could say, because of their religion, I want to take this city as my own. And then I could fight a religious war and take that city. And it's their capital, I believe. Which is awesome. Because I don't know what happens if you take that, but... I know. Lady, trust me, I know what's going on. I really just need to keep unlocking units. No Gandhi. What would you give me? What would you give me? 
Yep, sorry buddy, I, I can't. Sorry, Gandhi. Sorry, buddy. Not, not today. Not today. Okay, anyways, enough sad Zachary. Man, they really did build a lot of stuff though. They're probably really good at the whole adjacency bonuses thing. I'm not that good at it. Okay. Like I said, those guys will stop the spread. And I can start fighting my way south. I mean, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cities. Is there a way to check all your cities at once? Trade route overview. My benefits. Man, my trade routes are pretty decent, in my opinion. Available routes, none. Okay. You're gonna go this way. Okay, I found a city state. Which is good. And I can claim a great person. Okay. Alright, so we've got this guy. Woo! Jeez. You got a sweet looking ship. His passive ability is improving combat strength. Okay. For movie tortoise. All right. I'm gonna slowly convert everybody to movie tortoise. That is my side strategy. Five, six, one, two, four, eleven, six. Got Brussels over here. Right, I'm slowly uncovering more of the map, so that's that's good. It means I'll get farther ahead. All right, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna make these guys link up with this guy for the sake of safety. All right, and like I said, get a settler down there eventually. At some point, I'll do that. At some point. What do you need? Build a plantation. Can I buy a settler? No, too much gold. Okay. Alright, maybe I can buy some religious units real quick. Apostle. You shield them. What other units? Okay. Come on, Nidoros. Oh, I'm already selected. Yep, I'm sure that looked great. Awesome. So I have two more apostles. Which is good. We can use those guys. Send them over to the Conca. Or maybe I can do it down here. I can send them over here and I can just start invading that guy. Wherever they are. Get a nice... For I need to have like an impenetrable fortress of doom right here. So that nothing can beat me. So I'll probably start just pumping out settlers like mad. There's French scouts in here. Which bothers the crap out of me. Nope. No, man. I'm sorry, Queen of Sparta. Uh, I'm not just gonna give you wine like that. For borders. No, well, my borders. It's not gonna happen. I'm better than that, you see. Much better indeed. I'm much better than this, much better than that, much better than what you want me to do. <laughs> Two gold per turn and chocolate. You can keep your chocolate. You can keep this. Okay, seven, eight, 
9, 10. Okay, how about 11? How about 12? How high are you willing to go, buddy? Let's see. 16? Okay, 16? Is that 18? Ooh, how about 20? You want to do 20? How about 22? Oh, you want to do 22? How about 23? 24? How about 25? Okay, how about... How about... Let's do 30. Wow, you're willing to pay 30 gold for wine. You must be... You're just rolling in money. Okay, 30 gold. 30 gold per turn. I will take that. Thank you, Congo. Man, I'm glad we go to the same church. Worshipping the great Taurus. Has its benefits. <sighs> That's great. That's great. I'm not going to get 30 gold per turn off of that deal. It's fantastic. Off of a bonus resource, no less. It's not even a luxury. I think it's just a bonus... Oh, it is a luxury resource, yeah. So, that's awesome. I'm okay with that. Hmm, okay. They'll have their commercial hub, which is good. And then I can just start working on other things. Awesome, and I have metal casting, which is great. Steam power, so I can start getting better ships. Market. 